really reflecting now on the, um, the old part of life and um, we have so much to offer. We can take these messages across the world and educate everyone and share and say hold on to it. Don't destroy and dispose. These things have stood here for more than 200 years. They were made to last. They were made to serve generations, right? And here today, we live in a disposable, profit-bearing and unbearable society, which is going to trouble us, seriously trouble us. Our, our life, what we promote very dearly. So without further ado, I'm going to take you on a walk just here and uh, explain why it is so important for us to now protect and safeguard what we've got. And uh, much, much, much said, many who are here, it's a, it's a lack of education, lack of understanding of the history that doesn't allow them to be connected to a location or know um, how to relate to that um, location simply because we look it from the outside but pause yourself for a moment um, if you look at anything we do in life um, we are troubled by many um, aspects of fear and that fear has been caused simply because of um, uh, the fear means uh, profit, um, distrust means profit, um, disrespect means uh, profit once again because you can somewhat make money out of people suffering and their fear um, and I don't want to do that. What I'm doing here is actually bringing the trust back into the people and make them feel who they are, question themselves to feel why they are. See this, they're putting all the emphasis on to creating, being creative. There are no Pokemon Go that you use your iPod or an iPad and they go down the street and they walk straight into a, a ditch or straight walk straight on to, how are you sir? Uh, straight walk, straight walk onto a um, um, middle of the traffic middle of the traffic or middle of um, a bin you fall straight with your face down on um, uh, yeah uh, on, on, on the floor um, you don't tend to uh, become creative any longer as the creativity has been taken away from us simply because um, um, the creative aspirations are uh, no longer being trained um, to our DNA aspirations. Um, we become uh, much of a po Pokemon on the go and we become idiots ourselves. Um, and the laws and the, the game makers are making fool of you. Um, but we have is a, a great history for us to follow very much uh, without, without falling out of these um, histories that we've got in front of us. And much said, uh, very little will be understood for individuals as they progress um, because we tend to follow the one in front rather than follow our own selves so um, I'm back in the the square where many things occurred many um, ups and downs unsettling moments um, all things that life brings took place here and it is that that we need to remind ourselves remind ourselves to be human right because those histories can give us the opportunities for progress for better better today and for better for tomorrow and not just for yourself but for everyone around you and um, 
outfitters. This is, yes, I'm wearing one of those as well, yes. So, Sharan, don't be ridiculous. No, I'll try and be as least dressed as possible where the environment permits. Otherwise, I'll become a fault or a, um, I'll become a fault or I become a burden to that environment or I rule, I beg the rule of that environment. Yes.